what's up guys welcome back to another video in today's video we are checking out the out of bounds smg i think this is the first ever omelon smg that's actually been good and worth talking about in the crucible so for that reason alone i'm pretty excited as you can see we're on titan we're actually not using peacekeepers but that would be an option i'm gonna use doom marchers uh with either a ragon hilt or a wastelander i'm gonna actually probably swap between both and see what i like the feel of more let's get into the gun it's an out of bounds with full bore which is obviously great we need that max range being an smg armor piercing rounds and then the reason i really wanted to try this thing out was because it can roll killing wind and rangefinder rangefinder obviously as i'm sure you all know is incredibly important for range in the crucible and then killing wind gives you plus 20 range off a kill so i'm hoping we could chain some together go on some nice sprees uh as you can see we're on sunny's account so huge shout out to sunny for letting me check this thing out and uh without further ado let's get into it okay x was blue i haven't played titan in a while this might be strange but arc 3.0 titan sounded fun so we better run it up Free kill, we take that. That feels really nice. Shield up from the guy behind. I just, oh, I think he got hit by my nade. I was gonna say, he's got chunked out of nowhere. Dude, this thing actually feels fucking good, holy shit. But yeah, the shotgun too. Let me know if you want to see a Wastelander Enhanced video, because I plan on making one of those. Wait, what the fuck? This thing's actually nuts. Yup. Everyone's getting shit on. This thing's actually crazy. No, I can't find anyone. I got right up in here. Let's try to fight this guy. Okay, he dead. Can trade with him? Damn, nice play. No, gotta yoink that. Whatever. Got the other guy. Easy cleanup. That's tough. Having a bad day. Somebody check on that man. Come on, I want to front. I'm just gonna chase this guy. How he turns. And that is already a GG. Yeah, I actually wasn't expecting this to be as good as it is. It's actually, I mean, granted, it's like a perfect roll, but holy shit. We went 21 and 2 with a 15 streak. Easy first game. I'm going to try it in sixes, but yeah, this thing's insane. What the fuck? All right, so the first impressions on Rumble were really good. I want to try it in like sixes or I can take some more fights. So we hopped over to Control Endless Veil. It's actually like a perfect SMG map as well. Too dead. Oh, what the fuck? It's an enemy. Oh, I got him, but there's another guy. Killed up and then turn around and fight this guy with my teammate. He dead. I have killing window, so I won't take a fight. It's two, I can't. I'm not gonna get shot to charge too because I can't sprint. The tag. Damn, it's awkward. One. Two dead. Oh, they're in a well. Bye. There's one kill. We have killing wind. Two. Damn, man. Missing the shotgun. Not a bad game. Definitely could do better. I was just dying too much. We still got a lot of kills. The SMG does feel really good. We got 31 kills. A lot of deaths. I'm not a big, uh, I'm not a big Twilight Gap fan, but for the SMG, it could actually work pretty well. No way. I hit my fucking teammate, bro.
two, three. Oh my god, okay. It wasn't really an SMG play, it was more about the shotgun, but that was still sick. No way, I had to reload. I'm dead now. Come on, we're good. Yeah, I feel like that, whenever I get that speed boost perk thing, it just fucks my movement up and gets me killed more than anything. I don't know if I'm a fan. You guys are gonna drop on me. Yeah, this thing does feel really fucking good. Damn. If I had a lightning nade, I would've killed that guy on the flag. Of course, we mercy whenever I'm on a good game. The game was really good, though. Uh, yeah, I like this thing a lot. I am impressed. Probably won't be that high kill because we did mercy and we were just farming really quickly, but... Good game plan nonetheless. We ended up dropping 20 with a 20 efficiency. I think I died once, so 20 and one. Really good game. Let's try another sixes game. Now we got dead cliffs. Okay, we got away with it. Two piece. We able to get this trade easily. He did have one house, but it was fine still. We hit the other guy with a nade because I got a hit marker before I shotgun, so. Oh, hi. Roller died or something, I don't know, but we take it every day. Fuck, man. So risky. Wait. Did someone spawn behind me? Yeah, they did. What the fuck? Was so risky when I was that low. He has one more, so he might actually reach out. What? Okay. I think now we try to make a slam play. We'll take that. Given how low we got early, we take three kills from that. Nice. I stole perk, but thankfully he missed every single bullet, so we're okay. Yeah, okay, goodbye, buddy. Sorry, I'd like, I was gonna. Stop peeking him because he had a rift and knocks on stuff, and I saw he was reloading, so it's actually winnable even though he had like the rift and stuff. I'm so weak here. He made some peeking for me though, so we're okay. Oh my god. Holy shit. Alright, we take that. No, no, no. Oh, I'm dead. Never mind. Goat. Never mind. I'm probably still dead. Is that storm chasing me? Unfortunate. Wow. I think my teammate teabagging on the left. The fuck? Even with SPMM, I feel like we're getting lobby balanced. 39 with a 2.6 just for the loss. You hate to fucking see it. I wouldn't play one more, but I mean, we got a lot of kills that game. I was dying a lot. We ended up losing, but we got burnout. It's actually perfect. We're going to five stack, but. I killed that with heavy. Wait, he was weak enough to melee? I'm actually surprised I got that kill. Oh, the five stack's on my team, not against me. I actually got outside. I want to go for this. Nice. Got killing wind off him, so we probably have the range for this now. Oh, he's so low. Wait, he challenged? What a fucking psycho. Nice. 
Nice. My teammate actually helped me out a bunch that I was screwed if he didn't peek. Shit. Alright, so I get out of this, I think. Alright, she did, maybe? Okay. Then I am alive, but. Nice, two piece. Nice. As soon as you get killing wind up and actually just go for some SMG kills though, it is really impressive. Dude, fuck. Clean, straight headshots. Go for a flank. Nice. We need like one or two kills to close this out. Dude, scary when he starts getting himself back there. And GG. Holy shit, the connection. I don't know why that guy's so laggy at the end, but at least the game was over before it started lagging. We got a lot of kills that game, and I feel like the SMG, we're kind of showcasing it well. We're going some primary sprees. It does feel really, really good. We got 38 with a 3.17. Okay guys, thank you so much for watching today's video. I hope you enjoyed. This SMG actually really surprised me. As I'm sure you could tell from my reaction to that very first Rumble game, it actually gave me like straight up multi-mark vibes. I know it's a 900 RPM SMG, so it does kill really quick, especially if you're hitting those crits. But yeah, uh, this is actually very easy to get, much easier than the multi-mark, which you have to sup. Well, you can't even get anymore, but you did have to suffer through Iron Banner to get. Now you can just play some Crucible, go for your Pinnacles, rank up your Crucible, or even just get endgame drops and throw the... Crucible Posterity mod on your ghost and see if you can get one of these because this thing is really good. It's definitely worth checking out. Uh, I hope the gameplay did it justice. I felt like we were kind of popping off. If you enjoyed today's video, please be sure to like and subscribe. Let me know in the comments down below if you've got this thing, what your favorite role has been, and let me know what videos you want to see next. I do have a 1v3 video planned soon, uh, but it's not going to be a normal trials video. I think you guys are really going to like it, so uh, keep an eye out for that. Be sure to like and subscribe, and I'll catch you on the next one. Peace!